we're doing some fabulous repertoire. The format of the festival is the same from year to year, but the contents are what make it so exciting for me. Uh, and I think for our musicians, we're doing some very challenging, but very accessible and delightful repertoire. Then, of course, for me personally, I get to repeat my magnum opus performance of the H.K. Uh, Gruber uh, Tour de Force Frankenstein, in which I get to turn into a pig on stage, which some say is character uh, appropriate. And we have a new program this year. We're very pleased to have our first vocal apprenticeship happening at the festival this year. Uh, we have two vocal mentors, Adrian Rosas and Celine Mogulnicki, uh, who've been with us as soloists in the past. We're excited to welcome them back. There's so much energy in Chestertown and in Kent County when the musicians are here. And I think the community really enjoys having these young, passionate musicians um, performing for them, but also the opportunity for our local community to get to know the musicians, interact with them, not just come and hear them at concerts, but to meet them in other formats as well and, and to host them in their homes. Um, and to come to the rehearsals because all of the rehearsals are free and open to the public and it's a really interesting opportunity to come and see how the music is put together leading up to the performance. It's also a especially great opportunity to bring young people, very young people who may even be too young to come to the concerts, but if they come to the rehearsals, if they're infants, if they're young, if they make a little bit of noise, we don't care. The opportunity for them to be exposed to some really interesting and some delightful music uh, that kind of opportunity is one that got me interested in music and we're happy to pass that on.